everybody. Whew, I tell you, I'm too, getting too fat, I think. I, my cardio is like a three out of ten. And I like, I literally jogged like 20 feet, so yeah. <sighs> Feeling fat. So, anyhow, we have got a big project. Well, I guess it's big, big rock pile there, big rock pile there. We are going to be putting in a feed pad. And we're going to be trying to get this done pretty daggum as fast as we can. So, probably going to be working. We're going to be working past dark tonight because there's a chance to rain on Sunday. And I got to get this daggum thing done. While I've got the skid loader and some dry ground and everything to do it. So, we are putting in a feed pad to feed hay on this winter. Um, I haven't gotten my panels yet. I got to pick those up this week. Um, but we're going to at least get the dirt work done and get the rock laid and get the post put in um and then we'll take care of everything else later so anyhow what i've got to do is i got to take this electric wire down and get all that took down and cut open so i can drive the skid loader in through here um what we're doing is it's going to be 24 foot long and 32 Foot wide so we'll have eight foot space in between to put the bales in 12 foot um, section for the bales put two bales in there and then we'll have 12 foot on each side and on the end for the cows to stand on so we're gonna get this wire pulled down so that I can drive the skid loader in through here and then we're gonna get it measured out and paint it and be good to go so that's where we're gonna get going so hopefully y'all enjoy and um we're doing this by code within rcs because they will pay for some of it um if we do it to their specifications so we gotta put eight inches uh the number three's down and we've got to put two or three inches of the dense grade on top of that so i've got plenty of rock um so that's not going to be an issue and we're going to Hopefully get into this ground. I don't think it's too hard. I mean, we've gotten a rain recently and stuff, so shouldn't be too bad. But we're going to get in here and see what we can get torn up and leveled out and see what we can get done. it got dark on us um so we've been it's, uh, it's probably going on midnight now um 
we have got all the dirt work pretty much straightened out i'm probably gonna go over a little bit in the morning um but we are pretty daggum good we've got the four posts that are going to the panels are going to bolt against or bolt up to we got those in the ground and we've got them leveled out and i've tamped some dirt around the bottom of them to keep them and to hold them steady and keep them straight and now we're going to mix up a couple bags of quick creek um for each post um that ought to get them in there nice and steady because they're going to be pushing on these posts an awful lot and the panels themselves will help you know keep everything held together um but i'm gonna go ahead and throw concrete in here by the time I get the concrete in here and get all that rock packed against them get the panels on them shouldn't go anywhere so we're gonna run down to the barn real quick and grab our grab our concrete bags and uh, we'll get back up here and mix them up and uh, get to pouring some concrete in these posts and calling it a night. Um, <clears throat> I really probably wouldn't be spending this much time or be out here this late, um, but they are calling for some rain on Sunday. So tomorrow is Saturday and that's about the only day we've got to get all this stuff done because um, I got to take the skid loader back. And uh, I wanted to go ahead and get these posts in the ground tonight and get them concrete so that they can concrete can set all night and into the morning. And um, that way, when I go to putting the rock down, I won't worry about you know if I bump into one or you know just the rock being thrown up against it. I don't have to worry about the the posts moving on me and getting all loose. So we'll uh, we'll get the concrete in here and they'll be good and steady for tomorrow. And uh, tomorrow we'll get the get the rock um, laid down and we got a couple other projects we're going to tackle just a couple spots I want to add a little gravel to because I'll, I'll have some left over um, won't have a whole lot left over but I'll have some left over that I can throw on the drive and down by the barn um, just little things like that and then we'll uh, run up and get us some panels this week and um, we'll get those and hopefully maybe next weekend or something we can uh, throw those on there and we'll have a nice little uh nice little pad to feed some critters this winter so Y'all probably can't see any of that. It's a little dark, so we'll just cut the getting done. How about that? Well, what time is it? Twelve oh six. So I lied to you earlier. It's probably like eleven, eleven thirty earlier. But it's midnight now, officially Saturday. So that's cool. 
and I am a freaking mess. I am freaking tired. I'm hot. I'm sweating. I'm dirty. I think I got shit in my eye. But we have got all of these posts. All four posts are concreted in. So we've got that done. Skid loader parked right here. So hopefully the cows won't bother this tonight. I don't think they will, but you know, never know. Um, but yeah, so we've got those set in and that is what I want to get done before, well, tomorrow, which I guess is now today. So glad I was able to get that finished up and now tomorrow or today, later this morning, how about that? Later this morning, I will be able to uh, work on cleaning some of this extra dirt up and just making sure everything's nice and neat. And we will then throw um, the fabric down and we'll start laying some rock down. And we'll get the lock, rock laid down. Um, and once we do that, this light stay up here. Once we get the rock laid down, we will be done until I can go and get my panels. Um, and then I'll get the panels and we'll get all that attached. And we'll be rocking and rolling. We'll be good to go. I think this is going to work out really nice. Um, oh, I don't even know. I'm tired. I'm ready to go in and go to bed. Take a nice shower. The only thing is, like, I'll probably go in and take a shower, and then I won't be ready. I won't be tired anymore because I'll have a nice cold shower, and I'll be all ready to get back at it. But go in and uh, knock off and take a few hours of sleep, get up bright and early, and we'll get back at it. So we'll see you in the morning.